Hi friends, now we are going to talk about how we can find a particular transport that is that is moving a configuration request. Okay, so let me tell you what I'm going to find out. So if I go here and you can see here is plant 1710. In order to configure this plant, you need to configure it and then move a transport from a development to QA and then to production. Now, how will I know? which which customizing request has this particular plant so so how we can get it so first we will do a reverse engineering so imagine i am going to go for a transaction code se09 and here for some reason i know this is the transport okay now in this way there is generally what is the approaches you go and find a customizing request and all those things and get get it so this is one approach where you can try to find all the customizing requests that has been released and from there you can find it now if it's a big if it's a big system where a lot of people are working this can be very tiresome another way is is a approach you go to sc16 and you go to suppose e071 table and here you give the object name as t001w and now if this is related with plants so if it's related with uh, uh, with uh, company code i will put t001 okay so here i will put this and here are all the transfers but the problem here is i don't know which key field it is picking up because it can have a transport related with another plant i don't really know so again how we can get that information at one go there is everything in sap is a table e071k this is the table name and here you can give the table the object name t001w and here you can pick you can just put suppose i want to find the plant 1710 so i can just put 1710 and i put start just to make sure because sometimes there you have client and i execute and here i can find all the transpose that really move the table key which is the plant 1710 and 100 is just the is the client name client number of the system so in this way you can find the plants and if you want suppose i want to find some company code okay i don't know whether we have a company code created with this same yes we can find so here you can see this is the object type table update and this is the table and from here we can find all these details so this is very very essential in finding which is the erroneous transport because this you want to do just to want to make sure which transport moved and who moved it by mistake or something and you can find the issue Okay, so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and have happy SAP learning. And if you like it, share and subscribe to it and have a great day.